There are various leadership styles, each with its unique approach to guiding and influencing teams or organizations. Here are four common leadership styles with examples. 1. Autocratic leadership. In an autocratic leadership style, the leader makes decisions without much input or involvement from subordinates. They tend to have a high level of control over the team and use a top-down approach to direct their members. Example, Steve Jobs, co-founder and former CEO of Apple Inc., was known for his autocratic leadership style. He was deeply involved in every aspect of product development and decision-making, which led to innovative and groundbreaking products like the iPhone and iPad. 2. Democratic Leadership The democratic leadership is a style in which the leader consults with their subordinates before making decisions. This style can be effective in building trust and morale, but it can also be time-consuming and lead to indecisiveness. Example, Indra Nuri, former CEO of PepsiCo, was known for her democratic leadership style. She encouraged collaboration among her team members, promoted diversity and inclusion, and sought feedback from employees at all levels. 3. Transformational leadership. Transformational leaders inspire and motivate their teams by setting a compelling vision and encouraging creativity and growth. They focus on the personal development of their followers and foster a sense of purpose. Example, Nelson Mandela, the former president of South Africa, exhibited transformational leadership during the anti-apartheid struggle. His vision of a democratic and inclusive South Africa inspired millions, and he emphasized forgiveness and reconciliation during his presidency. 4. Laissez-faire leadership Laissez-faire leadership is a style in which the leader gives their subordinates a lot of freedom to make decisions. This style can be effective in situations where the subordinates are highly motivated and self-directed. However, it can also lead to a lack of direction and coordination. Example, Warren Buffett, the chairman and CEO of Berkshire Hathaway, has been described as having a laissez-faire leadership approach. He trusts his managers and gives them considerable freedom in running their respective businesses under the Berkshire umbrella. It's important to note that effective leaders often use a blend of different leadership styles depending on the situation, the needs of the team, and the organization's goals. The best leaders are adaptable and can tailor their approach to bring out the best in their team members.